Hi, YouTube family. Um, I'm doing a video because I decided to just catch you guys up on some things. I know I haven't been on in a while. I just really haven't had anything to talk about. But, um, I'm doing really good. Getting ready for bed. I, uh, got some genie bras. I ordered, um, some genie bras. And I ordered an extra large because I'm kind of busty. And I'm going to send them back and get a large to see if the large fits better. But I ordered them. They came at, They came within a week. Um, they're very, very comfortable. I tried one on. I tried a couple on. And they were extremely comfortable. I didn't want to take it off, but it wasn't supporting me. So, baby. That's my baby in the back talking to y'all. But, um, they were extremely comfortable. And they just didn't support me the extra large, so I'm going to get a smaller size. So if anybody's trying to figure out, okay, I'm going to get the genie bra, what size do I get? I would say get a size smaller than what you are, especially if you're larger in the chest area. Because I'm larger, I wear a size 36 F now because I've had the baby, I was a double D, but I've grown and I, I'm an F now, I think, like a triple D or something, whatever that is. And um, I was breastfeeding for a while and things like that. So um, I grew. And I felt, I saw them online. And I was like, you know what, this looks like it's a, a good investment. I got six bras for like $65 when it was, it would regularly be like $90 or something like that. Then they gave me like an extra or something off. Um, which they have all those promotions all the time, so it was nothing. As far as my daughter, she is six months. She just was six months as of the 15th. And she's crawling. She's pulling up. Um, she's actually crawling over here right now, right this second, to be nosy. But she's been crawling for about a month now, so she's crawling very well. And she just started pulling up maybe um, about a week ago. She started grabbing hold of the table and anything she can get her hands on really and pull up on it. So um, she does that and she like get on her knees or stand on her feet and then she'll fall back down. She's not like moving her feet or anything. If she was doing that, that would be like super amazing. But she's not. Um, she's. As far as that, I mean, it's nothing really to say. She, um, I'm in school. So anything different with me, I'm in school. Um, <clears throat> back at home now, doing really good. I try to get work done in between time when she's taking a nap or sometimes she just has to sit down in her playpen or her swing or her chair or something. Watch TV. She has your baby can read. And um, I think it's really working. She does have that. Um, baby, she's all the way over here. She was all the way on the other side of the room. Hi, mama. But um, <clears throat> she does have the your baby can read, and every all those people who are debating on whether to get the your baby can read or not, she's still young, so she hasn't really um been around it that much, or she hasn't really been like in front of it that much. But I let her watch it at least like three times a week. Um, if not more, it's really, she really likes it, she likes the song, she likes the little kids talking, she likes everything about it, so, um, I do let her watch that a lot, and, um, she's not talking, of course, yet, but she can raise her arms, it's, it's one of them, it's like a little portion that says, you know, arms up, arms down, so then she started raising, having her arms up, if you say arms up, nay, she'll put her arms up. Um, she's not clapping yet, she tries to, but she hasn't really got the hang of it. Um, and she reaches, it's, um, it like shows you how to reach or whatever. And she started reaching when she was like four months, she started reaching for me and my mother and her dad. And, um, what else? I, I don't even, it's like, it's, but it's really good. So far, I really like it. Um, and then it has like the little cards where you play, where you do with the kids with on the little card or whatever. So if you get that for your child, it's, I think it's really good. I wouldn't suggest that you buy it from Your Baby Can Read or from somewhere 
that has it for a hundred dollars i got it from walmart the same exact thing all five of them for um like sixty dollars i got all five from walmart and that that's the same thing they would sell on the tv for like a hundred something dollars which is ridiculous so yeah if you if anybody's thinking about getting your baby can read i say go for it just make sure your baby watches it um it's really i think it's really good and i think that soon soon by the time she's one she'll be saying some words a little bit of words and by the time she's two she'll be saying a whole lot of words i'm not even worried about that and as far as i don't think it's really anything else that <coughs> hi mama that i want to talk about just the genie bra um good investment but make sure you get a small a size smaller and your baby can read a uh, great investment um just make sure you your baby watches it i don't think if you have your baby watching it once a month it won't work as quickly as it will work if you had your baby watching it a few times a week so other than that um i'll see you guys later when i get my new genie bra in and i'll try it on everything i'll um let you guys know how it is and how it feels and how it fits and everything so Everybody have a great, what is today, Tuesday, and um, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.